everybody welcome back and we are on day four of our animal crossing new horizons let's play on my brand new island hydrangea um so not much to talk about actually that's a lie i played some on my own yesterday and i have some fun new developments to show you but of course we need to get into the game so without further ado let's get started Morning announcements. Hello, Tom Nook. Today's news. Ta da! Today, Hydrangea has its very own museum. It's a grand museum indeed, with separate exhibit rooms for fish, bugs, fossils, and even works of art. Blathers, the museum curator, says he is always available to accept donations or assess fossils. Museum admission is free, so stop by whenever you like. Also, my staff, Timmy and Tommy, opened up their new shop! Yay! It's a small shop, but they'll change stock daily and carry a selection of goods sure, sure to better your island life. Ooh. From 8 a.m. to 10 p.m. daily, if and if... Wow! If the store is closed, simply use their drop-off box to sell your items. One more thing. Celebrate the opening of the shop. We've added a new catalog service to Nook Shopping. Catalog lets customers see a record of items they have obtained or purchased. Any mass marketed items can be ordered directly through the catalog, so make good use of it. Excellent. With all that said, I hope everyone takes advantage of the new Nook's Granny. By the way, whenever we cover big island developments like this, we'll hold a special commemorative ceremony afterward. We'd like as many folks as possible to take part, so stop by Resident Services if you're interested. One ear never fails. Of course, this would happen right in the middle of a broadcast. He's getting a phone call. Hello. <laughs> this is Tom Nook. What the getaway package? Why, yes, yes, of course. And that's all for today's island-wide broadcast. So sorry to put you on hold. Allow me to give you a full overview of the getaway package. We've got more people coming! Very exciting. So this is what I did. Um, I, I placed my flowers so that they can breed. So over here is, wait a minute. Yeah, over here are yellow and red pansies of course these ones have to grow these are white windflowers these are orange and red windflowers over here is our white pansies so these will make blue pansies these ones will as they've already done make pink Windflowers. These ones, I'm not quite sure. So these are yellow mums and white mums. So the white mums together make purple. But you have to make special yellow ones to make purple ones that'll make green ones. It's very complicated. Yes, Viv. It's very complicated. That's what I said. Okay, checking our mail. Okay. Oh, I did get, um, I thought I didn't get that one, but I forgot it. Didn't come. Uh, the KK song. Um, collected lots of furniture. I got some points for my, um, from the Happy Home Academy. And Daisy May, I'll be heading to your island every Sunday morning to sell my precious turnips, just the way my grandma used to. Oh, Daisy May is here somewhere. Let me open up this stuff. So, open up that one. Open up my telescope and my present. It's a fireplace. Okay, let's put away some stuff. Actually, I think I want to put my telescope outside. So, I will put my fireplace inside. Over here. There we go. Perfect. Love it. And then I will put my music away and head out. 
So what do we need to do today? Lots of things need to be done today. Um, here's our money trees. <gasps> this is a house now! Can I come in? When did you get a house? It wasn't there yesterday! Hi, Quinn! Morning, Sunbeam! You here to make sure I start my day off, right? I want to chat. I've officially moved on from tent life. Oh, I just <laughs> sped right through that. Tents are cool and all, but I can fit way more stuff in a house. Plus now it finally feels like I can actually live here instead of just roughing it. Makes sense. I'm so, I thought I had to do something to get them houses. Guess not. Um, let me go talk to Mott. <gasps> Daisy May! How much money do I have? 50,000. Okay. Do you know my Graham Graham Joan? She seems to know an awful lot of folks, so I always ask. Anyway, she said I'm old enough now to help out with the family business, so here I am. Totally forgot to tell you what the family business is. Selling turnips. Have you heard of the Sow Jones stock market? I'll be here every Sunday morning with a fresh crop of turnips, so come by and come and say hi anytime. I forgot the sales pitch. Graham Graham told me enough times. I ought to remember how this goes by now. Do you want to hear about how Sow Jones' stock market works? Yes, please. Um, okay, you can do this. So turnips are a cute little root vegetable that are good for pickling or stewing. Ugh, Graham Graham always says that the stock market turnips are for selling, not eating. I always forget. Anyway, if you time things right, they can be mighty nutritious for your bank account. Should I keep going with the explanation? I mean, I need a refresher. Okay, now let's see then. Yeah, the whole point of buying our turnips is so you can turn around and sell them at a profit. Graham Graham always says something about turning turning up a profit. I don't exactly get it. <laughs> Me either. Anyway, you know Timmy, right? He's always in the market for buying. When it comes time for you to be selling, should I keep going? Let's hear it. Okay, this is a really important part, so I'm going to try my best to explain carefully. You don't want to buy these turnips and keep them for too long. They'll rot after one week. So if you buy some for me on Sunday, you gotta remember to sell them before next Sunday. Got it. Graham Graham always says there's nothing worse than a tent full of rotten t turnips, but it ain't true. Losing all that hard-earned bells you spent on them is worse. Okay, that's the whole speech. So right now, turnips are going for 97 bells. Do you want to buy some? I'll buy some. How many should I put you down for? Selling bundles of 10. Nope. One bundle. I think 10 is good for now. 970, yes, I'll buy them. Thank you kindly. Give me my turnips. Turnips, turnips, watch them rise. Try and turn a nice surprise. <laughs> She's so cute. Okay, let's... Look at my Nook Miles, because I earned some miles for stockholders. That's good. Active Island Resident. I've played for three days, so yay. Um, let me make sure this notification is gone. Is Mott here? Yeah, hello! Hello, Mott. Morning! I just finished my morning workout. This is for you. Chat with you. Guess what? I finally own something that even I have trouble lifting. Yep, I have a house now. Yay, we've got walls, floors, even a ceiling. I can finally do jumping jacks without ripping a hole in my home. <laughs> what do I have to give him? Oh, maybe I just have the opportunity to gift. I don't need to gift him something. That was weird. Okay. Let's go to resident services, maybe? What do I want to do? Let me go put my turnips in my house. 
Or maybe I'll put them right here. Okay. Um, I don't know what I want to do. I feel so overwhelmed. Um, I need to go to the museum. Okay. Let me talk it out, right? I need to go to the museum to drop off the stuff that I got when the museum was closed. I need to go to Nook's Cranny. I need to go to resident services and celebrate the opening of my places. Um, and then I need to start on my daily tasks. So let's start, let's start with the museum, yeah? Hang on, I'm being paged. Okay. Storage. What did I come in here for? All my buggies and fossils. Move to pockets, 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 move to pockets. Moved pockets. You know what? I'll I'll put my telescope and my picnic. I bought a picnic. Well, while I was um off camera, I think it's very cute. I love the little picnic basket. Okay, to the museum. Don't run over flowers. Oh, he's so big. <laughs> He's asleep. Oh, hello. Wake up. I beg your pardon, I'm a bit of a night owl. More importantly, fit in the Kelly. At long last, Hydrangea Museum has opened. Press and feed of engineering, craftsmanship, and all good old island ingenuity. I am going to sneeze. No, I'm not. I thought it was going to, but I'm not. Of course, it was your very own donation that made this possible. So to say, so to you, I say thank you. I will give you a quick overview of Fine Institution's floor plan. Find there are entrances to the left, to the right, and into the basement. Each one leads to an exhibit room, wherein the donations collected thus far have been put on display. In addition, the far room at the top of the stairs is a gallery to display magnificent works of art. Though as of now, it's still entirely empty, but by my beak, it shall one day soon swell with wonderful works. Ahem. As such, we are still waiting for art donations, so I humbly request your assistance. Oh yes, that's right. To streamline the donation process, we will begin accepting multiple donations at once. Oh, yes, thank goodness. So I wish to know about any of our fossils, fish, sea creatures, or ugh, bugs, I suppose. Just call out, tell me about this, and I will happily do so. Anywho, by any means, do please take a gander at our collections. It truly is a thing of wonder. Alright, I've got stuff for you. Assess, let's my, assess my fossils first. There we go. I've got all this stuff. Oh. Ugh. I just want to get through this. <laughs> so I'm not reading it. Uh, make a donation. Let's see what part, what of my fossils are as new and what is not. Diplo skull I already have. Iguanodon torso. So saber tooth tail. Megacero torso. Popeye goldfish. Pill bug. Paper kite. Mole cricket. There we go. Splendid. Take these off your hands. I need to pull that out. Take the rest from here. Try to help you with anything else. No. Papa. Goodbye. Okay, whoops. I need to check my nook miles. I've assessed eight fossils. Okay. I guess I could pick up some fossils. Woohoo! Pick up some tree branches, I guess. My little coconut trees are going- oh, yes! Wahoo! 
Woohoo! Okay, let me get 10,000 out. Bury and hole. I'll pick it up. And then I'm going to try and catch this fish, because I think it's a sturgeon. Come on. Let me go up here a little bit. Oh! There we go. Come on. Dang it. Just the black bass. Darn. Make sure there's no DIY recipe on the beach. Over here. Nope, doesn't look like it. Okay, let me put my money tree down here. Okay. I hope those are far enough apart. If they aren't, it's a little concerning, but we'll figure it out. Um, I need to go to Nook's Cranny. Hello! <gasps> oh, I forgot what it looks like right at the beginning. I was first worried when I heard you were all moving to a deserted island, but this is much nicer than I imagined. It's so nice, even though we haven't been here all that long. Oh my goodness. In just a short time, Blathers has moved in and we were able to open up this shop. Experiencing new things every day has been a lot of fun. I'm so pleased to hear that. Actually, I came here today to check in on you all to see if you need any assistance with anything. It's our way of celebrating a new shop, you know? We sisters like to help whenever we can. Any island ideas come to mind? You're too kind, Mabel. We're just overwhelmed that you even thought to come and visit us. Oh, hey, I think... Something come to mind? Well, we still have some logistical challenges to overcome. We depend on mail orders for a lot of our goods. Having this shop could make it easier for us to obtain ready-made furniture and stuff like that, but we still need a clothing supplier. Aha! Something tells me that today's your lucky day. As it turns out, it's really not that difficult for us to get to this island. How about if I stop by every so often to sell some of our wares to your wonderful island dwellers? Wow, do you really mean that? Our residents will be so overjoyed. Yes, I'm right here. If we can sell goods here, it's a win-win situation for everybody. I suppose with that settled, I should head home and work out the details with my sister. Yes, please do that. Can't wait to see you here again. Hi! <laughs> Bye! <laughs> oh, Kelly! Sorry to keep you waiting. Thanks to your help, we've opened this amazing new shop. Our shop is named in honor of our beloved President Nook used to run. Welcome to Nook's Cranny. As you can see, we're offering ready-made furniture and items that can't be made as DIY projects. Also in the back cabinet with tools and other miscellaneous goods, we have wallpaper and flooring. Love to see it. We hope to fulfill all your shopping needs. Excellent. Let's see what kind of flowers they have. Ooh, they've got a wetsuit. Medicine. Orange windflower. Yellow mum. White windflower. Red pansy. Red mum, yellow pansy. I think I need red mums. I'll take five. Thank you. Oh, no, sorry. I didn't mean to do that. Okay. Um, I kind of want this typewriter. Do I have enough money for this typewriter? 2,000. I'll take it.
Where is it? Oh, there it is. Oh, I need to sell some stuff too. With our new job comes three new services. Oh, okay. Stock turnips. I've heard the turnip market is about to take off here on the island, so you'll probably see a turnip seller soon. I did. We'll buy any turnips you have on hand. The price is set in the morning and afternoon, so be sure to stop by. Don't accept turnips on Sundays. Services involves hot item of the day. The hot item will change every day. If you bring one in to sell, we'll give you double its normal price. Check the hot item on the side of the day on the sign in the front of the shop by ask or by asking us directly. The last new service we're offering is the drop off box. You can find it in front of the shop. Stay here in a hurry or the shop is closed. You can just drop off any items you want to sell. Easy, right? Easy. We'll pay you later by sending the funds directly to your bank account. And I should mention a few things. There's a handling fee and we don't accept turnips. And hot items will sell for just a regular price. That's okay. I think that wraps it up. Sorry about that. That explanation went on for a bit. How can I help? Um, I want to sell. Yeah, I know. No turnips on Sundays. I need to sell my fossils and my black bass. And I think that's it. Uh, 8,900. That's fine. Perfect. Thank you. Bye-bye. Oh, a lot of talking today. A lot of explanations. Um, let's go to resident services. Hello. Get our ceremonies done. Hello. Yes, of course. Don't worry about a thing. We can set you up a getaway package to include a lovely furnished home. Oh, not at all. We'll set up your moving date in a later time. No, no, no trouble at all. I just need to draw up the proper contracts. <laughs> I don't have a house for you. We'll get back to you very soon. Thank you. Kelly, sorry to keep you waiting. I suppose you overheard that call I just got. For some reason now, I've been advertising the Hydrangea getaway package. Oh, for some time now. Not for some reason. Oops. I wouldn't know. I want you know, out of the blue, we have three interested parties. That's great. It's quite wonderful. Thank you. Thank you. You're wonderful except for one minor little detail. None of our applicants are too fond of the notion of sleeping in tents. I'm afraid I got caught up in the excitement of persuading them to move here and I may have promised them full furnished homes. Three homes, setting aside the land, preparing all the furnishings. It's just too much for one raccoon. <sighs> but I can do it. Here you are, my hour of need. It must... It most certainly must be fate. Would you help me get these homes prepared, all three of them? Of course, I will have to give you a good and proper thank you for your assistance. Of course. Thank you, thank you so much. I'll never forget this. You're going to need some top secret instructions. When you're ready, come to use the phrase, what should I do? Agent Nook out? Oh, this is fun. <laughs> okay. Time to do a lot of things. Let's hold a ceremony, right? Oh, you want to take part in a ceremony? We're celebrating so many different things right now. Truly, it's a wonderful island moment. What ceremony do you want to take part For the Nook Cranny. For Nook's Cranny? Blended? Let's get started. I like to take pictures. That's why. Look how cute! Now then. Welcome to our dedication ceremony honoring Hydrangea's brand new Nook's Cranny. Yay! Thank you! Hydrangea truly started out as a deserted island, but there simply wasn't much here. But now, it's slowly beginning to develop, thanks to the tireless efforts of every- of, well, everyone, really. But well, mostly me. I like to ask Timmy and Tommy to say a few words as re representatives of the new Nook's Cranny. Did you please? Thank you, Hydrangea! Because of you, we've opened a proper shop. My brother and I will work hard to make it the best shop! And I hope we can count on your business. Oh, they're so cute. Yes, yes. Thank you both. Next, a few words from someone who made many valuable contributions towards seeing the cranny book built. It's too early in the morning. I say at like 10 a.m. Yes, yes. Kelly, uh, Hydrangea's very own Kelly. The floor is yours now, Kelly. Hang on. Anything to add? 
We are amazing. Woo! <laughs> My little alpi alpinist hat. Alpinist? Yes, yes, indeed. Thank you for your heartfelt and encouraging sentiments there. Everyone, please get ready to join me in bringing this ceremony to a close. Also, those wishing to take a commemorative charter sh should get ready to press that button. Yes, well then. With hope for our continued growth and celebrate to celebrate Hydrangea's beautiful nook's cranny. Hurrah! He's <laughs> so cute! This concludes our ceremony. Please do take care on your way home. Yay! Time for the museum ceremony. Or digging resident services. Whatever comes first. Hello, I have things to do. Let's hold a ceremony. Would you like to celebrate the grand opening of the museum? Interested? I sure am. Let's get started. Here we are. Now then. Welcome to our dedication ceremony honoring Hydrangea's brand new museum. Thank you! Hydrangea truly started out as a deserted island. There simply wasn't much here, but now, it's slowly beginning to develop, thanks to the tireless efforts of, well, everyone really. Now I think we need to hear a few words from Brad Blathers, who will be running our new museum. Blathers, the floor is yours. Residents of Hydrangea, once again, I am Blathers, your humble museum curator. I am overwhelmed indeed, overjoyed by the marvelous establishment we are opening here today. Ooh, this could not have been done without you and your considerable cooperation. I only hope that this island's rich ecosystem and treasure trove of species continue to inspire all. It has surely strengthened my own resolve to build a museum brimming with wonder. I say, I do hope you will continue your support of the museum's efforts going forward. He does talk a lot. Thank you for that rousing speech. Now let's have a few words from someone who contri whose contributions made the museum possible. That's right, it's Hydrangea's own Kelly. E. Anything to add? Good for us, we're amazing. Woo! I like woo. <laughs> woo! <laughs> Indeed, thank you for your heartfelt encouraging sentiments. Here we go. Well then, with hope for our continued growth and to celebrate Hydrangea's beautiful museum, hurrah! Yay! Thank you all! This concludes our ceremony. Please don't do take care on your way home. Excellent. Okay. Ooh, that was... <sighs> Feeling a little congested today. Okay. I need to do something else at Resonance Services. Oh, what should I do next? Like talking to me about um what should I do? So you're all ready to help me prepare wait, so you're already ready to help me prepare. Here's what I'm thinking. We really should start by building a bridge across the river somewhere. With three homes to build, I worry that we'll run out of space on land that's easily accessible. A bridge will open things up a bit and make it easier to get to housing plots during construction. So that's why I'd like you to start by crafting the parts for a bridge base. Get your DIY skills ready. And then you'll want to decide on a prime location for the bridge too. Okay. Do do do. Bridge construction kit. Once you've assembled your bridge construction kit, find a good spot for a bridge and then check in with me. It can be a little tricky to place the bridge, but we can talk if you have trouble or need some advice. Good luck. Okay. Whoops. Okay, bridge log stakes, which are these ones. 
how many do I need though? I'm in the way. For those of you that don't know, which is everyone, um, I don't have a dual monitor system. I just have one gigantic monitor. So I am in the way of certain things on the screen. So let me, we four. It has to be at exactly 15 pixels. Or otherwise it's gonna bother me. There we go, I fixed it. Okay, so I need four log stakes, four clay and four stone. I can do that, that's easy. Um, I need some wood, I have lots of wood. So let's do that first, yeah? Is that Quinn? That's Quinn. Okay, wood. Wood, 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 wood. I need to plant these. Oh, stop getting distracted. Wood. Uh, moved buckets. And I think that's all I need. It's just the one. I think, I think, I think, I think. I could make my own DIY workbench, but I'm gonna wait a little bit to do that. Okay. Oh, a lot of stuff to do today. And I'm waiting to hear back from my brother about something. We might be hanging out today, maybe, or tomorrow. Let's craft. Um, I need four log stakes. Oh, I have to do it one at a time. That's okay. One. Two. <laughs> I love when they go really fast. Keep crafting. Three. Oh, need some long states. Keep crafting. Four. You know what I forgot to do? Grab my clay and stone so that I can. <sighs> Ooh, my brother just texted me. Okay, what am I doing? Clay and... Stone. Uh, storage. Clay. Stone. Go back. I think someone's bouncing a basketball outside? I don't know, it sounds like it from inside my earphones. <laughs> it's probably more intense than that, like construction work or something. Of course it's construction work while I'm recording, but... It's fine. Are you making a bridge? Let's craft. I did it! All done for now. Hang on, I'm being paged again. I don't know what's going on. That's okay. Time to place my bridge. I'm gonna put it over here, by my house. Because that is what I want. Right here, here, here. Build here. Yes. Let me imagine it. Ooh. Oh, it's beautiful. Yes. I picked a spot for a bridge. Let the land connect. Right. I should water all my flowers too. Maybe I'll do that off camera. Tom Nook, I finished the bridge. 
actually finished my coffee before it got cold. That doesn't usually happen. I'm a slow drinker. Do you find a good place to deploy your bridge construction kit? I set it up. Splendid. Excellent work. Thank you. Then tomorrow we'll have a new bridge up and it'll be even easier to get around the island. Now that that's out of the way, it's time to start on some homes. We can wait for a bridge construction. We can wait for bridge construction to finish if you want, or just ask me what should I do whenever. Hmm? Okay. Um. I'm getting paged again. Hang on. Time for more things. I'm very overwhelmed right now. What I think I want to do is clean out my inventory. So I need to go home and put things away, and then I need to go and place my picnic and telescope where I want them to be. I think I want to start doing my daily tasks. Oh, you know what I forgot to do? Let me put this away. Forgot to check in. Let me put this away. Check in at Nook Stop. At the Nook Stop. Put in storage. Put in storage. This one I need to get assessed. Now those I need to plant. Okay. So let's let's go check in at the Nook Stop before I forget. Hello. <clears throat> Got a lot of stuff to do today. Hello. I need my my bonus miles. Let me look at what's in Nook Shopping. Ooh, they got a Nintendo Switch. Mesh cap. Leaf print red suit. Uh, KK Lullaby. I will buy. Glittery cheer mega and a football rug. I can't see how much they are. Um, big game celebration until 2.15. So I'll wait a little bit on those. Being paged again. Oh, nope, my uh, watch is telling me to stand up. Haha, <laughs> no, I don't think so. Sign off. Okay. So I want to... <sighs> we are done with that. Let me move it out of me way. Um, okay. Let's go look for fossils. Let's do that first. Look for my fossils. I don't see any here. Mm, no. Pear trees. Daisy May. Oh. Damsel fly. Let me look behind the museum. There we go. <laughs> I was like, how do I change the camera angle again? Okay. So I looked all over my little center island. So it's time now to move to the outside. So I don't see any stuff here. Pick that up. There we go. There's one. Fossil! Not a weed. No! Thank you. Make sure there's not one back here. I think I'm gonna set up my picnic and telescope back here. What do you think? Oops, put that away. I like that. And then I'll put my little picnic right here. Yay! So it can be a little, a little cute little area for stargazing. 
Okay. We're still looking for fossil spots. I can make another snow boy. I'm not very good at those. Oh, I forgot to check what my Nook Miles Plus is. Let's let's check the whole island for fossils. And then I can check my Nook Miles Plus. Whee! Here's a fossil! My almost perfect snow boy. Ugh, so sad. Okay. Tree branch. Ran into a tree. I ran into another tree. Not doing so hot. Ugh, Kelly, good grief. Not seeing any more. Tree branch. Let's go up this way. I forget. When Daisy May is on the island, do other island visitors come and visit? Or is it just... Oh, there's my DIY recipe. I was just zoning out in the bathtub when a great DIY idea popped into my head that I had to write down. My great idea is in this bottle here. Take a chance on it. You'll see. No, Don't tell nobody else about it. Harry. A kettle bathtub. Of course. Woohoo! Okay. That puts me at three fossils. I thought I saw another one. Um, from across the way. Over here, maybe? No? Huh, maybe it was the one that I picked up. I thought there were six fossils on the whole island. Every day. And the fact that I can only find three means either they're spawning on the cliffs... Or I was wrong. Which is fine. I don't mind being wrong. Can I jump over here? Thank you. Um. Okay. Let's get these uh, fossils assessed and donated. I forgot to check the recycling bin. Dang it. Every time. Oh, my chair's so squeaky. Chair's so squeaky. Hello. Uh, assess fossils. I'm all a flutter. There we go. More than one I see is. Alright, I found something that's not yet part of our Steam collection. Which means there is something that I've already got. I'd like to donate. May what? Megacero? Megacero's torso. Plesio skull and plesio tail. Okay. Gladly take these off your hands. Thank you. I'm fine. Excellent. Excellent. Take that. Got that taken care of. Hang on, one second. I text really fast, and sometimes when I want to put an exclamation mark, I put an N or an apostrophe, and then I send it because I type too fast. And um, then I'm like, do I correct it? Do they know what I meant? All that jazz. Kettle bathtub. Oops, I wanted to see how to make that. Iron nugget wood and a campfire. Okay. Don't really need that right now, but. Okay, DIY furniture. Craft your own furniture. Okay. Ah! Plus. Okay, so sell a hot item for a fortune. Chop down a tree. Grow a fruit tree. Complete DIY projects. I did that. And last but not least, 
build a snow folk. Okay. I was gonna do that anyway, so let's go build our snow folk. And then I think in order to chop down a tree, I need a, a iron axe or whatever it's called. Where's my vaulting pole? There it is. Which I have to make. Which is fine. Um, I think there are a couple of bugs that I need to... That only show up on... Um, Stumps? Go around the rock. I can't see it now. There we go. We'll go in a circle. Circle, 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 circle. I just can't let it go off the edge. Maybe I'll go in a, like, figure eight. There we go. It's a good thing the weeds don't interfere with your making of snow folk. You know what I mean? I think that's as big as it goes. That was my tummy. If you heard that. If you didn't hear that, don't worry about it. Okay, I think that's fine. Time to make the head. Oh, oh, oh don't go off the edge. Thank you. Kick it. Ah! 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 There we go. Okay. Now it needs to be kind of big, but I don't know how big. Like... That's not big enough. Let's go around this way really quick. Your perfect snowboy is here! <gasps> Did I make a perfect snowboy? It's only true because of you. Just point me in the direction of the nearest snow museum and I'll be on my way, because that's where I belong. Or you can stick around here and show the locals what a flawless snow creation looks like. I can't praise you enough for this top-notch snow sculpting skills. Whoa, that's kind of hard to say. I think it's only appropriate that I share a DIY recipe with such a gifted snow crafter. Let's see. I know, I'll show you how to make an ice wand! Check out your nook phone! It'll take a large snowflake too, so it's... What, what, what? I put your thank you gift among your belongings. Now you go on and craft an item that'll remind you of me. I was built cool and it's all because of you, bud. Thank you so much. Oh, my perfect snowboy, I did it! I'm so happy! Okay, got me a perfect snowboy. I built a snowflake. Thank God. And I... Built this perfect snow boy. Excellent. Okay, and my DIY recipe for an ice wand. Oh, star fragments. I forgot you need star fragments for that. Dang it. Okay. Well, that'll be for another time. What else do we need to do? Whoops. For this, oh, I need to chop down trees, plant a fruit tree sell a hot item. Let's find out what the hot item is. Shall we? Shall we? Jump, please. Thank you. And I can check the sign outside. I don't have to go inside, don't I? Here we go. Today's hot item is a campfire. Okay, so we need to make a campfire to sell a campfire. So how do we make a campfire? Oh, it just needs tree branches. That's excellent. And I have seven tree branches. So, come on. Let me go build a campfire. What did I just say that we were building? A campfire. Coordinating plans with my brother. Because tomorrow is a holiday. And I don't have to go to work. Which is very nice. I made a campfire. All done. Now it's time to go and sell my campfire. <laughs> so sorry. I hear a mole cricket. Oh, I built five DIY furniture. Excellent. I have so many nook miles. Oh, love it. Okay, 
here I come. Grab this really quick. Go into Nook's Cranny, sell my stuff. Hello. Welcome. What do you need today? I want to sell. What am I offering? A campfire? A mega Sarah torso, and I think that's it. Yes. 3,560. Excellent. Okay. Sold my hot item. Excellent. Okay, so now... Oops, get out of there. <laughs> Sorry, I just got a text from my friend Bianca. She streams and <laughs> she's debating getting, um, what is the game called? Forza? Forza, um, five maybe? Anyways, I was watching her stream and she was like, should I do the Hot Wheels? And I was like, well, yes, do the Hot Wheels. And it was a, a paid thing, so she couldn't do it. But now she's like debating if she should do it. And I kind of want to see it. I want to see the Hot Wheels. Because I grew up um, watching, this is probably not the same thing, but like we grew up with Hot Wheels. And we also grew up with um, the, uh, the Hot Wheels movies. I don't know if you've ever heard of the Hot Wheels movies. They're a hot mess. But um, I loved them. Um, Acceleracers, I think, was it uh, what it was called. Okay, I can craft a flimsy axe with my tree branches. Then I need some wood and some iron to make that one thing that I'm supposed to be making. Anyways, I think I'm gonna tell her to do it. Anyways, um... Because I want to see the Hot Wheels, you know? It's all about me. <laughs> boo boo, I need to craft, craft, craft. A flimsy axe first, right? Yep, got it. Keep crafting, and I need to craft this one. Regular axe. Woohoo! Okay. I got another message. Oh no. It's just from someone else. An advertisement, unfortunately. So, not that fun. Um. Axe. Okay, where do I want to chop down trees? This is so menacing, isn't it? Just to walk around with an axe like this. I think I want to do this one. Maybe one of the ones over here. One, two, three. Okay. So now I have two... Don't pick up the flower. Now I have two... Um, stumps that bugs can spawn on. Should probably put this away because it's it's making me nervous. Um, whoops, not that one. So now all I need to do is plant a fruit tree, and then we'll have done all of our extra miles. So I haven't planted an orange yet. So let me do that. Whoops, maybe if I. Here we go. Grab some oranges. And then I will plant one right... <gasps> no, that was probably a sturgeon. Dang it. Okay. It's okay. It's okay. I need to plant it right here. Plant. Cool. 
And I also got Nook Miles for that. So I planted an orange tree. Excellent. Love to see it. And then I got this one, grow fruit trees. So I can still do some of these things. So I can tend my flowers. Can catch snowflakes, pop balloons, but I'm not going to focus on them anymore because they're not the doubled ones anymore. So... I think I did... Oh, I need to check the recycling bin really quick. And then I'll have done all my daily tasks. And then we can move on to do the building of the houses. I think that's what we'll do. Yeah? I should put everything away. Everything that I have in my inventory right now. Just make everything clean. Nothing. Okay. Hello. Ah, uh, what should I do? But you want to start in the homes now? Yes. Please take these three housing kits. Excellent. With the housing kits I just gave you, you'll pick your out plots for three homes. Then, of course, the homes will need furniture and such. Each housing kit comes with a list of furniture required for its house, so be sure to read those lists. You can build everything DIY style, so let me just send you the recipes you'll need. Excellent. I think that's all for me. Thank you for all your help. Okay. What's this? What did I get? Have a nice video. Oh, I learned a lot of DIY recipes, so that's helpful. Um, but what did I learn? Let's see. Oh my gosh. Oh, I got a ladder! Yes! Chair, bed, log stool, log garden lounge, barrel, swinging bench, wooden blocks, classic pitcher, pot, iron garden, iron garden table and chair, water pump, mum wreath, orange wall-mounted clock, orange end table, and a hay bed. Excellent. Okay. First things first, let's choose our spots. So let me open my map, yeah? Okay, let's see. Hmm. Do I want to keep them all centralized? Not really. I kind of want to spread them out. I say we do one on each side of the river. So one on the left side and one on the right side, whichever ones that I don't know my lefts and rights. Something new you learn about me. I don't know my lefts and rights. Um, and then one above the river, but not on the cliffs. I think that'll be a good idea. So let's go over here. Um, on the other side of this. Whee! Um, I kind of want it to be right here. How's that sound? Let me... And then I'll pick up the stump with my shovel. Cool. And then I will place the house right here. Sing plot one. Oh my god, it's huge! Mm, yeah, I took down the tree. Should I take down the other trees? Let me imagine it. Yes. Yes. I should have taken down the other trees, but it's fine. Yay! I picked a spot for plot one. Excellent. My phone is ringing. It's Tom Nook. Hello, thank you. that you, Kelly? Yes, yes, this is Tom Nook. 
How goes your search for housing land? I've got some ideas. Stupendous. I'm relieved to hear that everything is going according to plan. Be sure to check the box in front of the plot for each home. It'll show the items required for that plot. Interior items should be placed in the box while exterior items should be placed outside around the plot. You want to make it look nice and decorative. Once you've set up all the plots for three homes and placed the required items, come report back to me. I'll be waiting at re in resident services. Thanks again for your help. Okay, what does this need? To all construction helpers, please submit items for this building following the specific check interior items. Orange wall-mounted clock, orange end table, and pot. I don't have anything to turn in. Exterior. Hay bed, swinging bench, and barrel. What's check procedures? Oh, this is just... Stop reading. Okay. Let's go up this way. Should I put a house back here? Do you think it'll fit? I don't know if it will. No. I'd love it to be all snug right there, but I don't think it'll fit. Okay, let's put the second one over here somewhere. Oh! Another fossil that I missed. Hello. Wahoo. That's not what I wanted to do. Um, how about right here? One, two, three. One, two, three. And I should make a ladder too so I can go up on the on the um, cliffs. Oop. One, two, three. And now I will dig up the whoops. Maybe if I chose the right tool. Goodbye. I hope my shovel doesn't break on me here soon. I don't want to have to make another shovel. Okay. Housing plot two. Perfect! Let me imagine it. Nothing goes. Yeah, okay. And then I'll I'll get another bridge afterwards. I got another call from Tom Nook. Hello. Sorry for the repeated calls. I forgot to tell you something important. You see, you'll need to get a wreath made from flowers. There are plenty of pretty flowers growing up on the cliffs of the island, so toodle toodle up there if you need to. I've already sent you a recipe for a ladder. It's the ideal tool for when you need to scale those cliffs. Anywho, keep up the good work. Okay. Let me open my map. Okay. I can't, I can't move my little cursor around. But I think I want, yeah, yeah. Yeah, let's do it. Let's do that. Right here, I think. Let's cut down some trees. Ah! Ah! Oh shit! I went behind the tree to save you all from the... <laughs> from the view of my getting stung. Okay. One, two, three. Two, three. One, two, three. Lots of hardwood. Okay. Now I need my shovel.
I guess I don't really need to do this. They'll get rid of them for me. But it just feels nice to be able to do it myself. Right here, maybe? Let me imagine it. Is it gonna get rid of my snow boy? Not that it matters. Oh no, it's not. Okay. I've got a little. Okay. Um. Let me. Let me write some stuff down. My handy dandy notebook. Do you remember um, Clues Clues? Um. Okay. Check interior. So we have a wooden simple bed, a wooden chair, and a classic picture. And yeah, I know I don't have anything to turn in. A log garden lounge. Lounge. Log stool. And a water pump. Go like that. So this is for three. Let's go to two now. Over here. Interior items. So we have wooden block stereo, a wooden block table, and a mum wreath. How do you spell wreath? There we go. <laughs> oh goodness. Yeah, I know I don't have anything to turn in. Yes, iron garden chair. Iron garden table and a birdhouse. Wee. Okay, last but not least, I need to go back to the other Oops, that's not what I wanted to do. Back to the other side to write down what was in plot number one. Run! Oh, I jumped. Whee! Lots of stuff happening today. Interior items. Orange. Wall, mounted clock, orange end table, and a pot. And then the exterior items. Whoops! Hay bed, swinging bench, and barrel. Hay bed, swinging bench. Okay, so I have got to do a lot of planning, so maybe I'll pause and come back when I've planned out everything and constructed everything, right? Uh, what else did I need to do? I need to, you know what? Maybe I'll go hit my rocks really quick before I pause so that we can get we can get some more iron. Yeah. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Dang it, I missed. That's okay. 
I don't really need a pill bug. Move my remove my holes. I need my other rock out here. There we go. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, more iron, that's good. I think I want to catch this tiny fish in the pond because it might be a goldfish. So there's quite a few different kinds of goldfish you can get. Here's my fishing rod. Well, oh, she turned around. Are you gonna look, or do I need to get rid of it? Oh, there we go. <gasps> it is a goldfish! I got a goldfish! Yay! Okay, where are my other rocks? There's one up here, I know. Back here. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay. You know what? I should create a ladder and go up on my... My upstairs neighbors are being so loud right now. I don't know if you can hear it. Did I do this one already? No, I didn't. I did that one up front. Okay. Dig a hole. That's not the hole I was on. Right here. What? Oh, no. One. Oh, there's this is a money one. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay. Lots of money. I would have liked more iron, but beggars can't be choosers, so. Let's go over here. Oh, there's a big boy in this pond. Do you think it's a carp? Or do you think it's something different? Well. If I cast it the right way. Oh, I messed it up. That's okay. Up here is my other rock. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Excellent. Lots of iron. Love to see it. We love to see it. Get rid of my holes. I think those are all of the rocks on this level. Let me get my vaulting pole out. Anybody over here? I'm stuck on a tree. I'm stuck on a tree. Okay. I don't think there's anything over here. I think we're good on rocks. Okay. Oh, let's go to resident services and build us a ladder.
Here we go. Oh my eye itches. I feel like every time I have a break in talking, something itches and I have to talk about it. Oh, very funny. Do I have enough to make a ladder? I do have enough to make a ladder. Yes. Woohoo! I'm done. Let's go climb up our cliffs. Excuse me. Um, where's my ladder? Favorite. I'm going to get rid of my other axe as I don't need it. I also need to pick up some mum flowers. <gasps> Pink mum already? Um, where's my ladder? I was looking right at it. Having trouble. Do I need it? There we go. Let me pick some flowers. Pick this one. I don't know how much we need of each of them, so I'm just going to pick a lot. Rocks? I don't see any rocks. Hmm. Oh, there's a fossil, though. Take that. Wahoo! No, close the hole. That's not what I wanted to do. Let me plant it again. There we go. There we go. Put my ladder back down. Pick up this one. Okay, I want to catch that fish. Hopefully it'll be something I don't have already. Come on, notice me. Yay! Oh man. Black bass. Is my inventory full? I have one more space left. Oh, fossil? There we go. No. Stop picking up weeds. Pick up some flowers. Pick some flowers, pick some flowers. Um. Okay, that looks like everything over here. Go over here. This is the weird eye um, water feature. Dang it. Yes! Come on. Oh, a shoe, of course. Uh, drop it. <laughs> Forgot I don't have any more room. Oh, that's okay. Um, D 
Do you see any rocks that I can break? No? I don't see any. I keep running into trees. I just destroyed that flower. Okay. I think that is everything. Okay. I got three more fossils, which means I got all six. Let me go back to the museum. Donate our fossils and our goldfish. Whoops. Hello, Blathers. I'm back for like the six billionth time today. Ooh. That felt good. Hello. Ooh. Yes, hello. Assess my fossils. Then I will donate. Each and every one. Oh, yes, they're all new. Love to see it. I want to donate them. I think I might. Ah, making plans. Make a donation. I want to donate my torso, my spino tail, my parasaur tail, and my goldfish! Several things. Let's take a look. It's blended. Here we go. I'm fine. Jolly good. Okay. Goodbye. Okay, now what? Um... I think what I need to do is to sit down and figure out how much um, materials I need for all of the things that I'm going to make and then make them all and then we can, I'll come back and we'll um, put everything in the houses, put everything around the houses and get ready for tomorrow. So we'll be back. Alrighty, we are back. Um, as you can see, I did a bunch, I wrote down my notes of everything I needed, I gathered materials, and I did a bunch of crafting. So now I'm going to drop off my excess crafting materials in my house, and then we are going to go and set up all of our houses. Oh, I moved myself. <laughs> I moved myself over here. 175. I like it to be very particular. 15, 175. Except I can't get it to 175. You know what? That's fine. Anyways, um, I moved myself over so that I could see um, what, how much I needed of stuff. Oh, I only have one iron nugget left. That's okay. Okay, now I've just got an inventory full of stuff you know what i should have done while i was on break get a second cup of coffee it's okay though i'll get one after this i'll have a second cup of coffee with lunch how's that sound okay so first we need to drop off our interiors check interior submit items go excellent and then I need to check exterior hay bed swinging bench and barrel okay hay bed oh I should probably there we go hay bed we'll put the swinging bench 
right here? I don't know. I don't know where the door's gonna be. Where's my swinging bench? Swinging bench, here we go. And a barrel. We'll put the barrel right next to... There we go. Right next to my hay bed. Yay! All the interior, exterior homes are ready to go. Okay, time for the next one. Which is back here. Wee! Okay. Check interior. Wood simple bed, wood chair, some items. I have all three of those. Confirm. Okay. Now the exterior items for this one are... The log garden lounge, the log stool, and the water pump. I'm just using my notes now instead of... Um, let's put the lounge. Let's clean up a little bit. I can move everything around once the actual house gets in. Bar log garden lounge. There we go. A log stool. Next to the log stool will be our water pump. Yeah! Hee 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 hee! Watering our log stool. Okay, do I need to check in here? Excellent. Everything is everything is ready to go for this home. Okay, so now I just have this one last one over here. Is that a no. It looked like a fossil spot, but I already got six fossils, so it should be. It's noon! It's time for lunch. Submit interior items. I wonder who's gonna come. Very excited. Um, and then we need iron garden chair and the table to go in front of it. Perfect. I'm gonna move this a little bit. Okay. And then right next to that, right here actually, will be our birdhouse. Excellent. Check exterior. Make sure everything's in the vicinity. Excellent. Ready to go. Wait, this means... Yay, I did it! Now it's time to go to Tom Nook. Hello! Hi, I did it! Hello, hello! How have things been going since we last spoke? Are you close to finishing the f finishing the plots and furniture? Everything's finished! Goodness, really? Thank you so much for all your hard work! That means the rest is up to me! I'll get started on home construction right away so we can welcome our new island residents. How to get this done quickly and to get it done right. Why, if all goes well, we could have someone in a new home as soon as tomorrow. By the way, I plan on letting the island know about folks moving in or out during my island broadcasts. However, once I know who will move into a certain home, I'll post the info on the sign for that plot. If you're curious, check the signs. And that's that, my friend. You have finished everything I asked of you. Ah, let me give you a token of my appreciation as promised. This is for you. Fence. Thanks. <laughs> exactly what I wanted. Make it easier for you to create yards or parks or other outdoor areas. I'm positive this will lead to some interesting new landscaping scenes here on Hydrangea. I'm thinking 50 pieces of simple wood fencing should give you an excellent start. In the future, I'll offer DIY fencing recipes so you can get by you can get by redeeming Nook Miles. Excellent. Selection will change daily and we'll offer a variety of designs. Visit, check the Nook stop sometime. Hmm? 
Couldn't have done this without you, that's for certain. Heck yeah. Okay. Well, I guess that's me done for today. I Let me make sure I got everything needed for this today. Let's see. Um, I donated all my stuff to the museum. I built a bridge. I selected my three housing plots. I built the furniture for the plots. I harvested my resources. Um, I checked in at the nook stop, checked the recycling bin. Um, I'll shake all the trees, pick up items from the beach, um, and stuff like that on my own. Um, I hit every rock. I planted the money tree. I dug up all the fossils. I visited each shop. Um, I didn't see any island visitors, although I think Daisy Mae counts as an island visitor, so she'll be the only one I see today. Shoot down presents, catch bugs and fish, check turnip prices and nook miles plus tasks, which we did. So I am done for today. I think this is going to be its own episode because it went kind of long. It's an hour and a half. Um, but it might be that we do day five with day four or maybe day five on its own. You'll see. You'll know. Anyways, I will see you all next time. Bye bye. Hi everybody, welcome back. Um, we are on day five of Animal Crossing New Horizons, um, my new island hydrangea. So without further ado, let's get back into it. Let me turn my sound up. Hello everyone. It's Monday. It's actually a holiday today for me, which is very exciting. We gained a new neighbor, anchovy. Oh, very interesting. If you have to see him, please give him a warm welcome. It's time for a final announcement of the day. And all you DIY loving island residents out there, I have a very special announcement. DIY veterans can now take part in a special customization workshop I'm hosting. Oh, yes. Learn how to customize will help you change up the look of any DIY project you create. I have no doubt it will broaden your creative expertise. I'll conduct this DIY workshop inside resident services. Curious crafters should stop by. That's all for me. Bye bye. Yay! You know what I didn't do yesterday was water my plants. Somebody's got the zo zoomies. Are you okay, honey? Um, can you open your mailbox, please? There we go. She's playing with my headphones. Or my earbuds. Hang on. Let me open this. Are you done being a nuisance? Jump! Go! Oh my goodness! She being crazy. Okay. Um. Let's see. My pear trees aren't done yet. Got all these. Okay. My bridge is done. Yay! Is the new guy up here? He is. I'll check in. Hello. I believe this is anchovy. Is my coffee cooled off enough yet? Oh, it's a little birdie. I love his sweater. Hello. Nice to meet you. I'm Anchovy and I just moved here all on my own. I can't play yet because I gotta unpack my snacks and my other stuff, like furniture and stuff. But come say hi tomorrow. Okay, he said hi. Cute little bird in his cute little sweater. Alrighty. Oh, I scared that fish away. Whoopsie daisy. Is there... Nope. No buggies on our stumps. Let's go talk to our other villagers. Really quickly. Oh, yes, she's making a DIY recipe. 
Can I learn what you're making? Sweet, this is really coming along. What you doing? What am I doing? What am I doing? Check it out, I'm making a mum wreath. I already know how to make a mum wreath. Yeah, I did. More or less, yeah. I should have known, you're always on top of stuff. Well, I already wrote up a recipe for a mum wreath. Here, take it anyway, give it to a friend or something. Thanks. Yes, it would. Sad. Happened to be the one I already had. That's okay, we'll just sell it for a little bit of a profit. Let me go to Mott. Oh, hello! Hey, Gilly, have a minute, check it out. Somewhere around Jumping Jack 5061. Good grief. Get the sense of total clarity and purpose, and I had an idea. You met Anchovy, right? The one that just moved here? Well, if we get enough hyper-athletes like that to move here, we could start our own boxing team. You know, or just have a bunch of cool workout buddies to hang out with. Either way. So, my idea was to stick decorations around. Then we can attract some first-round neighboring talent. I pitched this to Quinn and we both agreed. It should be you who throws out the inaugural first decoration. Your manhole cover, so your call. Game on. I'm gonna put it right here. <laughs> Ta-da! Who's this? Wait, where'd he go? Hello? There he is. Hello? Harvey! Hey, yeah. Hey, you live on this island. Yeah, I do. Thought so. I'm from, like, the next island over. My name's Harvey. Glad to meet you. You can call me Harv if you want. Wonder why no one ever does that. Is the V part just fun to say? Who knows? Sorry, I got a bit sidetracked there. I came here for a reason. Give me a minute, I'll remember why. Got it! I keep hearing about this island and how much folks dig the scene here. So I thought I'd check it out. I'm gonna start this Far Out Artists Collective and I'm looking for ideas. So what's the deal? You heard that this place was deserted, like literally a deserted island? You the honcho that put this place at the head of the class? Wait, this old noodle just had a casserole of an idea. What in the world is this language he's speaking? You should visit my island. Just hit the airport and tell him you want to visit Harv's Island. That's the name of my pad. Groovy, right? Anyway, nice job with you. I'm gonna stroll around and see what makes Hydrangea tick. Okay, Harvey. That was an interesting conversation. Hi, Viv! Welcome to the table! Or to the desk, I guess. Okay, so I talked to all my villagers. Time to go to resident services. I need to take a customization DIY class. DIY customization class. <gasps> Is that red? Oh, I went inside. It's fine. I'll do my tasks inside and then I'll talk to red. Can you go away, please? Well, you don't have to go away. Just don't lick my coffee, please. Hi, Kelly. Hello, hello. As you might have heard on today's broadcast, I'm offering a new work workshop on customization. I think you'll find DIY even more fun when you master this skill. I do hope you take a, me up on this opportunity. Will do. Let me just check this first. Check this second. Five days in a row. Uh, nook shopping. Let's look really quick. Cypress plant, garden gnome. Oh, I like the garden gnome. He's cute. Lots leaf print wetsuit KK fusion. Okay, let me illuminate on that for a second. Sign off. Should just press B, it would automatically though. There Here you go. Hi, would you like to talk to me about small ears? About that. Let's hold this. Oh, we can hold a ceremony for the bridge. Ready to dip your toes in the delightful waters of customization. Yeah, I am. I'd love to. That's the spirit. Let's get started. I believe a brief explanation about customization is in order. Honestly, it's incredibly simple. First, you'll need an item you want to customize, along with the required number of customization kits. 
Then you'll customize your item at a workbench. The design or color will change in the blink of an eye. I do believe you'll find this easier to understand once you try it yourself. So let's get started. Your goal for the assessment will need is to make a wooden wardrobe and then do some customization. The wardrobe will make, as well as the closets, chests, and other items that store clothing are quite useful. What, Viv? What's going on? Tell me about it. You can use them to easily change into any clothes you have stored in your home storage. You could use your custom colored wooden wardrobe to put on your own fashion show. That freedom of expression is just the sort of thing we enjoy here on Hydrangea, hmm? Oops, you're going to need the DIY recipe for it first. Let me just send that over now. Bing, bing. They are all set. Excellent. So come see me after you get a wooden wardrobe. Okay. Let me, oh, learn the, oh no, this is the mum wreath. And it, yeah. So what do I need for a wooden wardrobe? Wood. How much wood? Who knows? Probably four or five. But I have wood, so let me just go get some. Oh, I need to check turnip prices too. This in storage. Put this in storage. Open my storage. Do I only have 13 wood? Oh my gosh. That's not good. What's broken? I have a shovel. What was in this spot then? I don't know. Oh well. Oh, it might have been my, um... Axe, my choppy axe that I put away. Okay. I have some wood. I will go and make a wardrobe. It's importante. Okay. Yes, let's craft. All done for now. Now I talk to him. Hello, hello. What would you like to talk to me about? About that... What? Oh, wooden wardrobe. I clicked the right one. It means it's time for you to customize it. I'll give you the customization kits you'll need in a moment. For now, please set up to... Set up to the what? Looks like you're ready now with your wooden wardrobe. I think that means it's time for you to customize it. First, I'll give you some customization kits. Thank you! Next, pull out your wooden wardrobe and try customizing it. Wooden wardrobe. White. Cherry. Dark. Black. Green. Blue. Or pink. I kind of like the cherry wood one. How do I pick it? Did I do it? Yes, yes, masterfully done. So you've just seen customization. Customizing items is quite easy when you have a customizations kit and a workbench. And you take the extras from today as a gift to you, use them in future customization projects. As a graduate of my workshop, you'll now be able to buy any kits you need from the shop. Now for the most for the most part, you can customize furniture or other objects you made as DIY projects. However, some of the mass marketed furniture items sold in the shop can also withstand some customization. For example, you might be able to change an item's fabric or add a custom design to it. 
figure out what you can customize and how you can customize it to be a lot of fun. What? This concludes my workshop. Okay. Hope you enjoy this. Now take a break. I do believe you've earned it. No, I have things to do. My light's going all funny and I don't know why. I think it's just in the in the recording, which is a little bizarre. Okay, let me put my wardrobe away. Is it my mug that does it? I don't know. Very bizarre. Let me put it over here. I don't have anything to change into, but I can put a little flower in my hair. Denim cap. I'll put a flower in my hair. Whoops, I pressed the wrong button. Yes. Put a flower in my hair. I should get Nook Miles for that. Excellent, making a change. Love to see it. What's this? Oh, first time custom design. Um, let's see what our Nook Miles Plus is. Get fossils assessed, sell a hot item, spend bells to buy items, hit rocks, and refresh with a group stretching session. Okay, we can do that today. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. Let me get my shovel out, and let's go find some fossils. They're not going to be on the beach, but I'm looking for... Um, my DIY recipe. Oh, I want to talk to Red. Hello! You from around here? Hi, the name's Red. I work in sales, and you are? Kelly, what a great name. Intelligent, strong, can already tell we're gonna be pals. No, not pals, family. It's a pleasure to meet you. Would you mind if I ran an idea by you? So I drained her once art, and I got art to sell. Might be something to this. But I couldn't sell to just anybody. I'd need someone I could trust completely, as if they were family. And since we're basically cousins, and because I know you've got an uh, I for quality. I want it to be you. Want to look at a few things? I've got both art and furniture. Plus, you get my cousin's discount. You in? I'm in. I knew you could count on you. That is absolutely the right choice. I've got my boat anchored off the northern shore, and I'm almost done fixing all the leaks. Long story. Come have a look when I'm sell uh, at what I'm selling. You won't regret it. Yes! Art! Um... Okay. Do I have my ladder on me? No, I put it away. Well, there we go. Hang on a moment, I got coffee. Okay, here we go. Excuse me. That was very rude. Um, let me put my custom my wood away. Customization kits away. I guess I can put my tree branch and these away. Um, let me open my storage and get my tools out. Pockets. Okay, bye. Okay, cool. Let me go. I think I looked over here already and I didn't see any fossils. Let's look over here. Okay, no 
fossils. Uh, no fossils over there. Shall I scare the fish away? Hiya! Oh, oh, I did scare him. <laughs> fossils? No fossils? I don't see any. Hmm. Fossil. Yay! Okay. <gasps> and there's my little golden spot. Wahoo! Okay. And then I need to put this away, get 10,000 out, and bury it in the hole. Pick this up. Gotta remember to plant it when I get back to my house. Okay. Forgot to check the front of that beach for my DIY recipe. It's fine. I'll do it later. I hear an engine. Okay. We go up here. Oh, goodness. Somebody dropped something. That's not good. Whee! Okay, I don't see any fossil. I keep running into trees. I'm not very good at this whole running nonsense. Whee! Any fossils? No. I don't see any up there. Snowboy up here. There's red. Do you see any fossils up here? Up on the, on the ledge? I mean, I can't see all of it, so it's not super accurate, but it's fine. Okay, I'm gonna go see red. See this way? Yeah. Water. Down I go to my secret beach. Hello. Now this is where I usually get out a um ready oh sorry. Let me read this. Lo here's the pitch. Ready. At R Jolly Red's Treasure Trawler, we sell only the finest. There's nothing finer than fine art and rare furniture. Am I right? Of course, I can't let all this fine things just walk out the door. I gotta limit you to one piece of art per day. It's a hassle, I know, but I hope the cousin's discount will make up for it. Plus, I'll let you buy all the furniture you want, no questions asked. So take a look around. We've got masterpieces by the great masters. Plus stuff for your master bedroom. Oh, I forgot it's Monday. I just got a text that my HelloFresh box was out for delivery and I was like, what? But it's Monday, so that makes sense. Great masters, plus stuff for your master bedroom. Let me know if you have any questions. Um, I'm trying to remember which ones I, I like. I know Wistful Painting. I want a closer look. Oh, this one's... Yeah, this one's real, because she's got a pearl earring. So I will buy it. Sold. Cool. Let me see what kind of furniture he has. A clock and a plant. 
Ooh, true patron of the arts. Excellent. And then I also spent... Oh, I haven't spent all of it yet, so that's okay. Goodbye, Red. Thank you for your business. Or he would say thank you for your business. I don't know why I said that. <sighs> okay. Goodbye. Um, I'm missing some fossils, but I'm not gonna look that hard because we could be here all day. And I don't wanna be here all day. So, let's see. What do I need to do now? How many fossils do I have? Four? Let me plant my money tree. Where can I plant it? I will plant it up here. Plant. There we go. Okay. Um, I should water all my plants at some point. Maybe I'll do that off camera. No, go away. Uh, let me check turnip prices. And see what's in Nook's Cranny's shop thingy. Hello! Welcome to Nook's Cranny. Got a little bathroom stand. I like this thing. I do want some of the stuff from... Uh, turnip prices. 58 bells. Nope, we do not want to sell them for less than what I what I got. Um, okay. Actually, I need to sell this. Oh, no. Okay. I don't know what I'm doing. Let me go get some fossils assessed. Thank you. Goodbye. There we go. Okay. Oof, my foot's asleep. Hello, I need some fossils assessed. Good morning. Set some fossils. Two, three, four. More than one. Found something that's not part of our collection. Excellent. Yes, I'm going to donate it. Uh, make a donation. Plesiosaur torso. Terra. Katera? I think that's just Terra body. And Corporalite. Fun. Several things I see. Take a look. Gladly take them off your hands. Um, I'm fine. Okay, so now I can go sell my extra fossil and my DIY recipe. Let me do this. Oh, let me figure out what a hot item is. So let me go sell my stuff and figure out what the hot item is. And then I will try and sell a hot item for extra cash and Nook Miles. What's hot today? A kettle bathtub. Well, I want to sell. Problem is, I think the kettle bathtub needs a lot of uh, iron. And I don't have a lot of iron right now, so... Excuse me. Okay. Let me look. Kettle bathtub. Iron, wood, and campfire. So I don't have any of those things. Well, I don't have enough iron. I don't have enough wood. And I need to make a campfire. So... 
What else can we do? We can buy something. Oh, we can hit- we need to hit five rocks and do a stretching session. Shall we do our stretching session first? Let's do it. Let's do a little stretch session. A stretch session. Let's stretch. I'm almost done with my coffee. Begin. Okay. Okay, I can do this. I treat this like a game that you can win, but it's like, it's just stretching. go. I love the music. to be on time with the music. Dodos with their small arms? Yay! I love stretching. I didn't do my stretches this morning. I'll have to do that when I'm done here. Okay. Um, let me get my Nook Miles for that. Need to hit five rocks, so let me do that. Here's a rock. One, two. No. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Iron, that's good. Oh, what I do? Oh! I hit a rock. I only have to hit rock five. I thought I had to hit five rocks. Um... Let me... Oh, I'm gonna get stung by a wasp again, aren't I? It's fine, I'll risk it. No, oh, I need regular wood. Give me regular wood. Excellent. Okay. What does the kettle bathtub need? A campfire. Let me move myself really quick. Eight iron nuggets. Oh, good grief. Let me put me back where I'm supposed to be. There we go. Um, okay. Well, I've got some more rocks to hit. <gasps> no! I forgot about those. Oopsie daisy. I wanted to catch that bug that was on the stump. Here we go. Here we go. Iron, iron, iron. 
Yes. Give me iron. Oh, dang it. Only two. Okay, that's okay. This shovel is lasting me a really long time. It's gonna break as soon as I've said that now. I can tell you that right now. That's how it works. Okay. One, two, three, four, five. Oh yes, lots of iron. Yay, four! I think that's enough now. Pick them all up. Yes, nine iron. Okay. And I need enough tree branches for a campfire. How many tree branches make a campfire? I can't remember. And I'm in the way again. Three. I like it to be exactly the right pixels, okay? Ignore me. Okay. Let me, just in case. Okay, we're good. Give me some tree branches. Three, cool. Time to go do some crafting. Oh, beautiful. Big stretch. Oh. Okay. That felt good. Ah, uh, yes. I should craft something. Craft a campfire. And then a kettle bathtub. I wonder how much I'll get for that. Let's find out. Ooh, lots of cracking going on. Could put that away. Oh, I changed to my watering can. I did not mean to do that. I have a hot item for you! What to sell? This bad boy. That's twice the usual amount, so... Holy shit! 12,540 bells? Sold. Take it. Okay. Oops. Okay, so now I just need to spend some money and we'll have done our our Nook Miles for today. Our Nook Miles Plus for today. Mm -hmm. Let me go back to resident services. I think I'm gonna buy a wetsuit so that next time we play, we can do some deep sea diving, right? I think I want the garden. Oh, I don't, I think I can only get two things. So I'm gonna get this one, this one, and let's see if I can get the garden gnome. Yes. That's it. I think that's all I can get. Or maybe it's five things. You can't get up to five things. I don't remember. Okay. I can attend my flowers, plant flower seeds, plant trees, grow fruit, catch damn fly. Okay. I don't really need to do anything else here. Let me check my daily checklist. Okay, so I checked the nook stop in the recycling bin. 
Um, I didn't find my DIY recipe on the beach, did I? Should I go do that really quick? Hello? I don't see him here. Maybe he's over here. No, there he is. You know how you get so bored during commercials? That's when I came up with this recipe. It's too good to keep to myself, so I threw it in a bottle to share. Show, show it off once you're done. Oh, I already know this Yeah, but dang it. I want something new. Okay. So I planted my money tree. I dug up my fossils. I visited the shops, um, looked for island visitors. We had Red and Harvey. Excuse me. Um, checked my turnip prices, Nook Miles plus task, and I talked to all my villagers. So I think we are done for today um, in terms of recording. I think I'm gonna do I'm gonna do some shakedowns. I'm gonna water my flowers and um Oh wait a minute. Yes. No! Is there one over here? No. Oh, I didn't get close enough. Okay, well, next time. Next time. Um, but until then, I will uh, uh, see you all later. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.